Let's look to our Bibles right now and um, let us hear what the Lord say yes. um, to us today. Um, and please stand. I won't be long because I ain't got my, my notes. Mm -hmm. Amen? Amen. I'm coming from Luke 13, okay. verses 18 and 19. And it reads, What is the kingdom of God like? And to what shall I compare it? It is like a pine seed, which a man took and put in his garden, and it grew and became a large tree, and the birds of the air, the eagles, nested in its branches. Father, thank you. We love you here today, Jesus, Lord. I ask you to touch everyone here, Lord, and you answer all their prayers, answer all their dreams. Lord, even go back into time and touch things that, that, that went wrong and, and bind them up, oh God, and, and travel all into our future, Lord, and make the past clear for us yes, and straight, God. Lord. Yes. Help us, Lord, as we move on today. We love you, Lord. We thank you. We lift you up. Amen. We give you praise, honor, and glory. And in your holy name we say, Amen. 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 Please be seated. The title of my sermon today is Decide. Make a decision. Okay. And I'm preaching about make a decision when I read just about what Christ said the kingdom of God is. He said it's like a, it's a, it's like a pine seed that a, a man planted in his front yard and, and, and that it grew and that eagles came and, and rested on its branches. And I read that to you because, first off, Jesus is saying that, that God is using things that we find common. You see, and we think that we have to decide to do something, we need something else. If I'm going to decide to go to church, I need a new world world. Yes. Come on. If, I, if, if, if I'm going to have a church, I need a lot of people. Mm -hmm. huh? if, if, if I'm going to help somebody, I need a lot of money. Mm -hmm. If I'm going to go to business, I need a lot of help. But the Lord God is saying that when, that when God himself decided to do something for you, he used things that were common, that were in his hand already. And I'm telling you, when you make a decision to do what God told you to do, you need nothing else but yeah. what's in your hand. Right. Amen, amen, amen. When the Lord told Moses to go down and free those people, he told Moses, Moses says, and what shall I free these people with? And God said, what is in your hand? And, and yeah. here today, make a decision about yeah. anything you want to do. Yeah. Whether it is today to start a business. Yeah. Whether it is today to, to, to find a spouse. Whether it is today, whatever it is that is on your heart, if you just make a decision, right. things Amen. happen. Amen. Amen. And I'm going to explain this this way. <laughs> the Bible says that in the beginning God created the heaven and the earth. Mm -hmm. That implies that God made a decision. Yes. Hear me now. If you want to create a new life for you, decide. Mm -hmm. And the first thing that happened when, when God created the heavens and the earth, the Bible says in, in, in Genesis 1 that the earth became a void and a chaos. Yes. So just because you decide, don't think things are going to happen for you immediately. Because you might decide to do something great. You might decide to climb a mountain and you, you walk with a limp. You, you might decide to do whatever it is. You might decide, I'm going to write to speak five languages and you can barely master English. Come on. You might de decide you're going to run the marathon and, and you can't even walk up a flight of steps. And, and it looks like a mess to you. It looks like a mess to somebody else because sometimes when you tell somebody your dream, they tell you it looks like a, a, a void and a chaos. But the thing about making a decision just like God did, once you make a decision, it seems all of a sudden, you see your way through the chaos because the first thing God said after his decision, when he said, let there be light. That's right. That's if you right. make the decision, you're going to see your way through. Yes. It might look like chaos in somebody yes. else, but make a decision today. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Make a decision to live the life that God told you to, to live. Yes. Yes. Now, don't be no punk for the enemy. And the reason right. why so many of us don't get through life is because we sit back and let life happen to us. Mm -hmm. we, we, we go along to get along. Mm -hmm. The Bible calls that being tossed to, to and fro, fro That's right. with every wind of doctrine. Come on. You can live your life and, and, and go from cradle to the grave and never accomplish anything. 
Nothing at all. And you can live in the richest country probably ever existed. Mm -hmm. but, but a poor man mm -hmm. from a far, far yeah. country yeah. who has decided right. to, to make his way through That's right. can come here and overshadow you. It's not because they're better, it's because that person has decided and you can, can decide today whether or not you want to live this life on your knees or standing on your feet. Right. We, we, we ought not be afraid and we wonder why I don't have anything. Come on now. Why everybody has everything? Why am I a failure? Because you haven't yet decided. Mm -hmm. You can push people around all you want, but, but bump into somebody who has decided they're going to take it no more. You might push them around, but then you, you might feel a pain in the back of your head, and you see a bright light in your side of head. Because people who decide they're not going to have it, just is not going to have it. And you got to decide that certain things you're not going to have. Yes, come on. And when God decided to create, the next thing he did, he, 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 he found that water covered the thing he wanted to create. And and, 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 and and he said to this thing, I, I decide that water is not going to stop my creation. And yes. the word of God said that the water moved. And, and, and just like the water moved for the people of Israel who thought that they were trapped. And what, because they decided to follow God and go where God sent yes, them, right. they found that water could not stop them. Neither hell cannot yes, stop yes, them. Yes. And, and when you decide to get anything done in your life, on, can't now. nothing stop you. Yes. Can't nobody stop you. Right, yes. right. Thank you, Lord. Yes. Thank you, Lord. And, and the Bible goes on and on to, to, to say how so many things happen as God went about doing this thing. And it's the same thing that can happen to you. Once you decide that I'm going to be what I want to be, yes. once you decide that I'm going to make this life worth something. Yes, yes. Once you decide, you can be unemployed today and decide that today you're going to find a job. Yes, you'll be surprised. Right. It, it might not be the job that people want. Yes. It might look a void and a chaos, but you can do it today. If you decide anything, I don't care what it is, you decide, you can get it done. Yes, yes. The yes. problem is that, 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 that sometimes when we haven't decided yet to, to follow Jesus, we find ourselves in the Adam and Eve problem. That's right. The enemy said to them, God done said to you mm -hmm. to decide. Yes, he did. He said that if you confess with your mouth That's right. and believe in your heart that Jesus is Lord, you shall be saved. Mm -hmm. But then like, like, like the devil did Adam and Eve, God didn't really say all that. Come on now. Huh? You don't have to say all that. You don't have to act like that to be saved. Do you tell you that? Yes, right. That's I, right. I can go to the bar, right? Huh? Mm -hmm. I can go to the bar with them and wear all, all, all the clothes that they, they should wear. Right. Huh? I can do what I want to do. And I don't and I have to it don't take all that. And that's what the enemy tell you. But if you decide to be an athlete, okay, you you are committed to that thing all the way. And if we just have half of the drive that an athlete has to decide that we're gonna do this thing, can't nobody tell us nothing. Come on. Can't nobody deter us. And, and Adam and Eve, they heard the serpent say, did God really say? And they didn't have, they made a decision to do what he said. They got confused. Mm -hmm. And every day we make these decisions to get confused. But if we ever decided to be single-minded about this thing, That's right. we can get it through. That's right. God is going to show you the way. Yes. God is going to move things out of yes, your way. Yes, thank you, Lord. God is going to create things for you that you've thank never you, seen. Before. Yes, yes. Lord. Yes, Lord. The, the thing is that we we don't believe that God can do these things for us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And sometimes we are satisfied with just having enough to eat yes. Yes. and a place to sleep. Yes. But but don't you want to have a life that means something? Yes, thank don't you, you want to do things for your family? Thank you, don't you want to do things for your children? Yes, don't yes. you want to do things for your friends? And you can do it if you just decide it. And I read to you this verse. And Jesus said, well, how shall I explain to you the kingdom of heaven? He wants you to decide to get to heaven. I want you to decide to get to heaven. Come on. Make up your mind right now. You don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. We saw Sister Beverly last week. Yes. And Sister Beverly passed. Yes. Just like that. We have to make up our minds right. today That's right. what we're going to do. 
And 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 and, and the main thing, the most important decision we we to make is that we we are getting into heaven. Come on. That we are getting there. And if you haven't decided, and, and most of us haven't decided that we want to get to heaven. Yes. We just have to be called a Christian. But Jesus said, if you decide to get to heaven, I'm gonna, you're going to see something that looks like a man planted a tree. Mm -hmm. And that's the problem about, about, about following the Lord. But, but you know why? Because it, 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 doesn't, it doesn't sparkle. There's no bling to this thing. No, they... There's no bag of money at the end of the rainbow. There's none of these things. There's, there's no woman with a body like a car. There's none of that. Mm -hmm. And those are things that we want. Yes, come on. There's, there's no Justin Bieber waiting for you to sing those songs. There's nothing that look like that. He says it's, it's a man who planted a tree in his front yard that eagles came to rest in his branches. What is telling you that? that? That in the beginning God created and he, he had the tree of life yeah, and that yeah. he wants us to get back to a place of paradise. Yeah. And, and, and he's saying to us, just like, just like Noah had to let out those small Little doves, those doves have now become eagles. And, yes. and, and, and those doves represent our spirit man. Yes. And, and our spirit man may go forth like a dove, you know, in, in, in a place where there is no, there's no place to set our foot like the doves of Noah. They, the work was covered in water like it was during creation. But God said that, 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 he, that if you decide to follow him, that he's going to find a place for you to rest. And that tree is nothing but the tree of life. Yes, yes. That yes. they had in the Garden of Eden. You, 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 you see, Jesus sounded strange to us because Jesus had heaven on his mind. Yes. He's been there. He saw it. And he wants you to understand what it is. Is, is that he said to you, paradise is not lost. Amen. That the enemy think that just because you sinned, you, 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 you can't get there. That's right. That they need to, to, to decide and want to tell you that you yeah. are canceled yeah. out. But if you decide to be canceled, if you decide to be not canceled out right. today, Jesus said you're going to get there. It's going to be simple. It's going to e be easy. Because yeah, God is not making it hard for you. He's making, he making it very simple for you to understand that if yeah, you God. just decide to get to God, you can do this thing. Yeah, yeah. and, 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 and you see, we think Thank sometimes that we have to get there with all the things we want to have. But the Bible says it's better to get there with, with, with one eye That's right. and one hand That's right. and, and just get in. And, 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 and we think it has to look pretty, but the Bible says that the kingdom suffered violence and the violence taken by force. Yeah. You got to push your way in. You yes. got to decide yes. that I'm going to be a good person. You got to decide yes. that I'm going to get to heaven. You got to decide that I'm sick and tired of, of, of living the way I do. That's right. You got to decide that you want more out of life than, 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 than what the crumbs that are thrown off the, the enemy's table. Yeah. Yeah, you got to yeah. decide that I'm sick and tired of being a fool yeah, over the so. same thing, over the same people, yeah. over different faces. Yeah. And, and I'm sick and tired of being a jumping from one addiction to another. Yeah. You got to say, I'm sick and tired of being the same old person I ever yeah, was. So. Yeah, you got to you yeah. make a decision today. Yeah, make so. a decision today that, that who among you yeah. is going to follow God. Yeah, and if so. you just follow God today, if you decide, I'm going to follow you, Jesus, if you decide. Yes, come on now. If you just decide, yes, yes. the first thing you want to see that God is going to say, let there be light yes. in your life. And, and, yes, and He's going to make it easy for you to see. Thank and and the waters, the things that have been a barrier for you, yes. is going to move out Thank your you. way. And secondarily, He's going to populate that new world yes. that you have created. Yes. Yes. You know, we think that we need what we can create. Uh -huh. but, but the word of God said that he brought into being things that have never yes, been seen yes, before. Yes, he yes, brought yes. birds. He brought animals. Yes, he, he brought so many things. Yes, and yes. the last thing that God created, what you will find once you make a decision that he provides for you in, 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 in this way. He makes your mind a new world that nothing can stop you. You yes, see, yes. you've never been seen, seen before. Yes. He says, furthermore, the last thing he did to people who decide to come to him, he said, I will make thee a man. Yes, thank you, Lord. And the man we want to see is Jesus. Yes. He, he was created on, 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 the, on, on the sixth day. Mm -hmm. And the sixth day God rested. Yes, yes, yes. That means that once you decide, God provides. Yes, thank you, Lord. He's going to bring to you the things you need. Mm -hmm. And in the end, you shall see our Lord. Yes, and yes. you shall find rest. Yes, yes. What shall it profit a man if he gains the world? Lose his soul. Lose his soul. That's right. Decide today to be a better person. 
Thank you, Lord. Make a decision. Make a decision with all your heart. Yes. Say, I'm going to love the Lord. I am going to do what God has made me to do. And you could be just going to be God's baker, God's plumber, God's candlestick maker. Come on. Whatever it is God has put in your heart to do, do it unto the Lord. You can be God's cameraman. You can be God's singer. Yes. You, you, you can be God's evangelist. Whatever he has, he has done, put on your heart to do, do it. Because when you do it, you're going to really see. Yes. Huh? Yes. Thank you, Lord. You won't need to struggle. Thank you, Lord. He will give you the things that you need. Thank you, Lord. Way beyond our understanding. Yes. The peace of God will pass all understanding. He will guard your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. If you only decide. Yes. Make a decision today. Yes, God. We make lots of decisions. We decided, I'm going to get something to eat. Yes. None of us stop you getting something to eat, does it? No, no, no. no. Make a decision to follow the Lord Sorry. and let nothing stop. You'll be surprised. Yes. That's how God created, by decision. Yes. And that's how you can create a new world, by deciding. Yes. And uh, Lord, I yes. thank you. Yes. I love you. I magnify you. I pray you. I lift yes. you up. And I give you praise, honor, and glory, Lord. Enable us to decide to make the right decision, oh Father God. To stop making decisions that, that bring us down or make decisions yes. that bring us up. But enable us, oh Father God, to grab hold of this thing and, and stop being afraid and, 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 and let us pick ourselves up and decide to be great, decide to be successful, decide to be honorable, decide to be great men and women of God. Help us to decide, Jesus. Lord, we love you, we thank you, we adore you. And your holy name we pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.